The Processing Foundation from the USA is the maintainer of Processing and P5.js. They have a few more projects which I really love, but mostly for my teaching I use Processing and P5.js. But in my videos I always use Processing. Is there a good reason for that? Well, I would say, yeah, kind of. On my platform, everything is translated to P5.js as well, but processing for me is more like the foundation, the thing that's in the history books, the stable one. It's a little bit more rigid in the way how it forces you to define variable types, which gives you more clarity in the way how you code. And it's also more sandboxed. That means your whole application cannot crash just because there's something like a loop that executes too fast. So it just freezes your sketch window, but not your processing application. I think these are the main reasons why I use that. Well, one more could be that I work a lot with motion graphics. I'm rendering motion graphics and I personally have a workflow for processing that I've built over the years that works very conveniently and very fluid and I don't see the necessity to switch over. Both processing and P5.js have their special areas where they are really good in. As soon as you work for the web and you want to create websites and web experiences, well, P5 is obviously the better option. What is your preference, processing or P5.js? Let me know in the comments.